Hello everybody, welcome back. Now, damn, it really sucks that my camera battery just died while I was like recording a match against me and Tesnogic, but if you were wondering who won, I, like Tesnogic won, like it was like 10 more seconds until I finally, finally met my end, so yeah. <clears throat> there was like still three more matches left to record, but I was like, uh, I think I'll stop there for now. So and let, let me just continue with with the other matches that I have. <clears throat> now, after I fought Tesnogic, I I'm not sure. I can't remember. Like if it was like a little while later, later in the day, or just like maybe a couple minutes later, I actually like. I was looking for someone to play, and, and there was Poyo Smash, which that name rings a bell for some reason. Like, they like freaking um. I was actually talking to him after the matches were done. Like, oh, do, oh, like damn, dude, you used to play on 360 and everything, and, and like, yeah. No wonder, no wonder the name and also the the way he plays Talkata is is familiar. Yeah. This was somebody that um, that, that I fought in th on three on three sixty. So yeah. <laughs> Good to see that his talk is still very annoying. <laughs> uh. I don't know why Fubu kid. Oh no, I am not getting almost... With meter? Damn, that, that, that would have killed me. Alright, the Ice Sword left, left, left her stun in, or, in order for me to do Ice Wave. Nice. Now, Takaka is really annoying to fight, but thank God I um, thank God I fight people again like Red Black One or Red Black One that I can actually like keep keep up against some Takaka players. <laughs> oh my God! Why did I drop this? Just when, just when I didn't get grabbed, I got grabbed again. Oh, encore. Man, everything Takaka does is just incredibly safe, and, and it's so fast. Like fucking hell, I was like, when I first saw some of her frame data, I was like, what the fuck? You gotta be shitting me! Like freaking hell, like. Because everything she does is save that I, I could I can't really mash out of her shit. It's impossible to do so. I shouldn't have done five five D. Oh my god. I knew it was gonna burst, but I didn't. I didn't bait it. Crap. Oh my god! I dropped another combo. Very beautiful. Damn. He didn't get gun. <laughs> That's my fault for trying to reset. Uh. That was a very close match, but I messed up ba badly. Like I tried to reset. I'm like, mm, yep, that cost me the match. It was very close though.
Hmm. I think I remember Severin and Senex Looney. And Se <laughs> I said Looney. Lo Senex Luna talking, talking, talk, talking on the chat in the online lobby, saying that supposedly like this stage is pretty, is pretty lagging. Well, I think throughout these matches we were playing in this stage, and it wasn't really that lagging. I think maybe because it was a pretty good three bar connection, and maybe that's why it wasn't lagging that bad. Maybe in, if it was like a lower connection, it, it would have. But but it was it was pretty fine, I guess. Uh, that was supposed to be freaking um Sekajin, not not too soon. Oh my god, there's so much reset everywhere. Yeah. That shit is so fast that I can't even, I, I can't even, I don't even know when that's gonna hit me. I know what's gonna happen. Oh my god, why am I dropping so much shit? <laughs> Oh my god, that cross up is so annoying. The fact that I Fubuki blows my mind, like why did I do that? <clears throat> that was supposed to be 6A. I didn't know you can astral into that. Never knew. <laughs> My 3C mess. I should just I am I am ice arrow, but I'm not sure if it would have worked. Cause I did add it too many hits, so My normal hits would not be Talcatos, like, they're much slower than hers. I can try to 5A or 2A her if I want, but yeah, it, 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 she would just beat mine, because <laughs> they're just that fast. I 
I don't know where my where my ice car went, but yeah. <laughs> if I did ice card, I would have done 4,300 and killed Pal. <laughs> Wake up into distortion. Yep, Classio. <sighs> yep, all the matches were in Snowtown, especially with less than. The wheel of fate is turning. Rebel one, action. <laughs> Uh, does that even work on Pal? I don't know. I'm gonna test it out. I could have done way more damage than that, but I was afraid that he, that he was going to burst. I don't know why they gave that back to her, but okay. Oh man, I just have a tiny bit of health left. I was like, mm. But I wasn't that desperate yet. I was like, hmm. Let me see if I can still turn this around. And luckily I did. Damn, with just that chunk of health, I took almost 95% of his health. That's a record for me. Because doing that on top Kaka, man, that that is incredibly hard to do. I'm not gonna lie. Like freaking having just a chunk chunk of health left and she has still almost still almost all her life, yeah, it's very hard. It ain't easy. Cause top Kaka has so much freedom, like freaking she could just do whatever the hell she wants. It's like ooh, like you gotta respect that at times. I gotta reset it again, shit. That, that shit is so annoying because it gets her great OP, like, to, to just do, like, an infinite possibility. Luckily enough, I was able to grab her and do, and do overdrive. You know what's funny? Like, I, I, I've been playing Jin all this time and I still haven't been doing that many overdrive combos. Like, I just don't really rely on overdrive with Jin. That, that often. 
<laughs> and they jump to five to five beam fans. Oh my god. You know, I should have uppercut it there. That 5B of hers is 6 frames, so like, I, anything I would have done would have gotten beaten. I have to block it. It's just so fast. The only thing that could even challenge that move is my 6 with my 5A. Like, that's it. <laughs> I'm pretty sure I was blocking there. I don't know what happened. Uh, I should just done 5C to to Sega Gym. Once I saw Overdrive, I was like, oh shit, this is gonna get denied. <laughs> <sighs> What sucks is that we only had six matches because I think he had to go somewhere, so I was like, oh, that sucks. Alright. Since I rarely get to fight Top Cockers, I was like, mm, this was some good experience for me. <laughs> I got perfect and badly. Like, Jin can, can tr somewhat keep up with Pal, but man, Pal just has the advantage in this matchup. I'm pretty sure I was locking low. I don't know why I tried to reset it. Right here, it was just like, damn, I better not fuck up anything. If I screw up, jeez, I'm dead.
That was risky too because damn, that would have gotten denied if, if I didn't do it. If I didn't do it right. I was trying to block that. I knew it was going to burst. There I wanted to overdrive, not burst. Ah, shit! <laughs> if I would have up uppercut it during her 6B, it would have turned the entire match around, but yeah. Those were all the matches I had against Foil Smash, so against Foil Smash and hopefully to play you next time. So I'll see you guys later.